Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Autotext is a useful, time-saving device that can save you from typing common or repetitive entries. With Autotext, you create an Autotext entry that corresponds to a larger word or phrase. For example, you could create an Autotext entry called Address and have it represent your company's full name and address. Then whenever you wanted to insert that information into a document, you could type the entry, address, and press F3 on your keyboard. Word would automatically insert your company's full name and address instead. Now this feature is especially handy because you can also save graphics with it. So a simple way to be able to insert your company's logo into any document would be to save it as an auto text entry. You could even save your own signature in a graphics file and then create an auto text entry called signature. So whenever you wanted to insert the graphic, you could just type signature into a document, press F3 on your keyboard, and insert it. Now Word is pre-programmed with some auto text. These include many common letter formalities that you type frequently, like cordially at the end of a letter. You begin typing the word, and when Word arrives at the letter in the word, that allows it to realize that you're trying to type an auto text entry, a screen tip will appear above the typing. And it tells you here's the word that you could insert and you just have to press enter to insert it. So at this point you could press enter or F3 on your keyboard to accept the screen tip suggestion. You must press F3 to insert the full entry at any time that you type the word and the yellow screen tip does not appear. If the yellow screen tip for the auto text replacement does appear, then you may just press enter to accept it, but only while the screen tip is showing. So notice if we typed something like COR, the screen tip's not up yet. So in this case, I would actually have to press the F3 key in order to insert it. Now auto text is similar in nature to the autocorrect feature except that auto text will not automatically change words. Autocorrect inserts the full entry anytime it finds the original entry. So for example, if you saved your logo graphic as the word logo using autocorrect, you would never be able to type the word logo without word replacing it automatically with your company's graphics file. But this isn't a problem for auto text, since you determine whether or not to use the feature every time you type the word. So for example, if I wanted to type the word cordon instead of cordially, I could start typing the C-O-R and I get to the D and the auto text pops up. But I can ignore it and just type whatever I want. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.